you've ever had to implement a rating bar from scratch, it can take a bit of effort. Next time, check out Flutter Rating Bar, a package that provides a ready-to-use rating bar. Start by initializing the rating bar, give it a minimum, maximum, and an optional initial rating. You can enable half ratings with allow half rating, and finally provide an on rating update callback that would be triggered when the rating bar is updated with a new value. You can specify whatever rating indicators you'd like with the ratings widget property. Whether it's hearts, stars, horseshoes, clovers, or blue moons, as long as they're widgets, you're good to go. Now your users can touch and drag the bar to specify a rating. Keep in mind, the rating bar will default to showing five indicators, so if your max rating is greater than five, make sure to adjust the item count accordingly. Tweak the indicator padding and size to get the rating bar looking exactly the way you want it. By default, the rating bar is horizontally oriented, but if a vertical rating bar is more your vibe, then try out the direction property. Out of the box, the rating bar also comes with a glow effect that you can customize or disable entirely. If you want on rating update to be called while the user is dragging the bar, set the update on drag boolean to true. On the flip side, you can disable dragging input by setting tap only mode to true. And finally, if you need to disable gesture input entirely, toggle the ignore gestures property. For more info on Flutter Rating Bar and all the other 5-star packages, head to pub.dev.